CU Boulder's Norlin Quad once drew in about 10,000 people for a 420 smokeout. This year, campus will remain open and there will be alternative events being held. 420 at CU has usually been associated with drug use, not drug education. The president of Students for Sensible Drug Policy, Elizabeth Henneman, and the Cultural Events Board have teamed up to change that. This is an event um, where we're trying to redefine 420 at the University of Colorado Boulder. We've been very clear in all of our advertising, this is a non-consumption event. Um, so unfortunately, you know, if we see someone consuming in the UMC, we're going to have to ask them to leave. Um, that's not really what this event is about. It's more kind of about um, education and activism as opposed to just con consumption. Um, and uh, there's going to be still a police presence on campus. This year's symposium will feature five keynote speakers, eight panels, discussions led by student organizations, organizations and more. Henneman is expecting a large turnout. And this year is our biggest year. We're in the UMC um, on 420. Um, in the past it hasn't been on the exact day so we're hoping to get at least 500 attendees this year. Although officials have cracked down on 420 activities since 2012, they say you can expect a pretty normal day tomorrow. Arely Mora, News Team Boulder.